I don't know about you, but since the last two and a half years, there's been an explosion, it appears, from research results I've seen online, of people with gut issues, bloating, GERD, anxiety, depression, skin issues, eczema, psoriasis. I'm one of those. I've had a ton of health problems the last two and a half years, um, and I'm trying to fight them now. And that's why I'm recording this video for. There must be other pandemic issues that people have had, health issues, that have got nothing to do with the C word, but have got everything to do with the response to it and how we personally have responded to that information as well. That's increased our stress levels, our anxiety levels, and they've given us a ton of health problems. I've got, I've had an array of problems the last two and a half years. Following on from psoriasis and anxiety and depression that I probably already had, well I did have, um, certainly psoriasis and anxiety. I've also had bloating, gut issues, food intolerance issues, stomach acid issues, itching, histamine intolerance. Um, psoriasis has been really bad, I mean maybe I can show you some of it if it's light enough. You can probably see there. So it's back again. Um, anxiety issues, something called air hunger, where you can't, you feel like you can't get a full amount of breath. Um, sometimes you have to force yourself to yawn to get yourself enough air, and that is really, really bad. Um, just a ton of other health issues. There must be other people out there, so this is just a video just to say that you're not alone. I'm going through that as well. I am starting to get better now. I am on sertraline or Zoloft as the people in the States call that. Just a small amount, 25 NG, which is enough for me. Uh, it's enough just to give me that first step on the ladder. Um, and it's kicking in now, I feel a bit better, but it's only temporary. I've got to do a lot of other work. I've got to cut out dairy again, which I'm struggling to do at the moment, but I just need to get rid of it and go mostly carnivore, which I seem to feel better when I just eat meat, particularly red meat as well. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, but yeah, anyone who's suffering from lots of health issues due to the response to the pandemic, not necessarily the pandemic itself, the C word, that really didn't bother me at all. Once I saw the information and the facts, I wasn't that bothered about that. Obviously for vulnerable people, I was, not for me personally. <laughs> It was the response to it, the loss of freedoms and things like that, and just the destruction of society. Still, still feeling it right now, but um, hopefully things are things are getting better now. Society's almost back to normal, um, which is nice. But still feeling the physical side effects of it all. If anybody else is feeling this way as well, please say hi and comment below and tell me how you've been feeling as well the last 12 months and two years two and a half years i'll uh, see you in the next video bye